photography and now music as well. So what influences me to get up and go after my dream every day? One is family. Uh, I come from a big family and we're all, you know, very supportive of each other and continue to push each other to, you know, move forward in whatever it is that we want to pursue. Secondly, will have to be just my drive to to create every day. I think that's what keeps me sane what keeps me alive, what keeps me, you know, looking forward to another day and, you know, wanting to just share my work and creativity with others. Some people that I've worked with uh, in the past and present are Miss Tina Knowles, Janelle Monae, Zendaya, Trevor Jackson. I've done some work for Netflix, Verizon, Karen Civil, uh, Hitmaker, and a lot of other people, and I uh, had some films go to multiple uh, film festivals as well. Uh, some of my favorite creatives off top would have to be my grandfather. He was a photographer and that's who got me into photography. Uh, he used to take photos of all his children and his grandchildren, great grandchildren um, in the past and he had his own dark room and seeing that uh, inspired me to pick up the camera uh, and learn. Some others would have to be Ryan Coogler, uh, Jordan Peele, uh, John Singleton, rest in peace. Um, the Hughes brothers who created Menace to Society. <laughs> one of my favorite movies. And uh, musically, we had to be Donny Hathaway, Donnell Jones. Who else? That's probably my top two right now. <laughs> my biggest obstacle career-wise was for sure learning my worth, learning what what it what I deserved as a creative and what I was given to uh, other people and how it should be reciprocated back to me from funds to just respect uh, it took me a while to actually understand the motions and moving in the industry and certain people uh, some people aren't for you they'll use you as long as that and as much as they can until <laughs> you know you, you're done or until they're done with you uh, and I had to see that, you know, firsthand. Um, and I think a lot of artists fall, you know, fall into that. You know, they there's people that you know tell you, okay, you can be doing this for exposure, or you know, we can do this for you. That's going to help you. When realistically, it's just it's only helping them. It took me a while to understand that, and who's pretty much the right people to work with, and the right people that that really want to help you. Uh, my biggest obstacle, personally, was. For sure, the loss of my mom. Um, and now that I'm older, I'm able to really maneuver those feelings that I had in the past and the feelings that I have now. And she passed when I was 12. So being the youngest at 12 and seeing that and trying to get over it and you know work through life without her uh, was tough. But luckily, I had my older brothers and sisters. Um, so within that, I fought with like suicidal tendencies, you know, falling into a creative path. That's really what helped me um, continue to live, <laughs> honestly. Uh, advice that I would give my younger self is to express my feelings, express everything that I, I, I'm, I, I feel inside my mind, uh, that I feel um, uh, when it comes to other people. Um, learn as, as much as possible, speak my mind, and to trust your intuition. Uh, I feel like intuition is a superpower in a way for us humans when you're able to, to feel you know, something in your gut and it's always what you think it is, it's always right. So I would say to continue to trust your intuition and just live life, have fun, be happy. Artists have bills too, goddammit, and it's important because we gotta eat, we gotta pay, we gotta, <laughs> we gotta, you know, live, and uh, without us, you know, it's, the world is boring, you feel me? <laughs> the world is boring, and the people that need us, 
you know, there there's no way for them to maneuver in their professional field without the artists and without us creatives um, that, you know, give the world some light and some fun and some color. <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> that makes sense, right? <laughs> What's up, everybody? My name is Adrian Javon. I just want to let you know that artists have bills, too, nigga. I'm playing, I'm playing. Well, you can cut that, right? Cut the nigga. <laughs> you know, you can. I did you